But either way, let's just go over here to the upgrade station. Let's see what saddles we're probably not going to use and just grind them up and get some stuff out of them. Fiomia saddles. I'm, I've got multiple of those. So I'll put those up. Yeah, look at that. Another one right there. Jeez. And Mosasaur. Would I use a Mosasaur saddle? I'm like, if I have a Mosasaurus, I should be able to make a Mosasaur saddle easily, right? I think it's really that big of a deal. Baryonyx saddle. That one's made already. We just unlocked the Engram for that, but we never actually made one, I don't think, right? So I guess we can keep that, and just in case we actually find a, a Baryonyx. Especially because I did read you guys' comments saying, Hey, a Baryonyx, if you got one of those, that'd be great for the ocean biome. Uh, there is the Asaur saddle. I'll put that up. I probably wouldn't use it. Metal shield, apprentice metal shield. That would be a great replacement for this, but of course it's a little bit heavier than our wooden shield right there, you know? So at least it will be able to deflect a little bit more damage. It has durability of 2,600 compared to, yeah, 453. I almost said 500 right there, but still pretty good. Riot Helmet, I, I don't know if I'll grind that up and get some stuff out of it. Maybe I'll just keep it as a Riot Helmet for right now. Maybe as, like, backup armor or something like that. That'd, that'd be fine. Permanent Pike, do I want to grind that up? Maybe. Yeah, let's grind that up, sure. Uh, Plesiosaur Platform Saddle, do I want to grind that up, too? Uh, I'll keep it for right now. Mosasaur, same thing with that one. Baryonyx, I'll keep that. Trike Saddle, 31 armor rating. Oh, I'll grind that up. 31 armor rating at Apprentice. Yeah, that's trash. <laughs> I could upgrade it to, like, was this Ramshackle and probably get, like, double that. Like, that's what we got with the heckin' Spino. It's, like, 50-something armor rating. So, uh, Hide Pants, we'll put that up. Another Fiomia. Yeah, we got a lot of Fiomia saddles. Sheesh. I kind of want to keep the Electric Prod, at least, for right now. Uh, and I think that's going to be it, honestly. Maybe I'll grind up that shield, too, just because I'm not going to use it. Or, you know, salvage it, I guess you could say. So, yeah, I think that's fine. Let's salvage all these items here. Boom! And it looks like we just got a bunch of Hide, Fiber... Metal, pol- or, uh, well, yeah, just polymer. I almost said, uh, organic polymer, even though it is just regular polymer right there. Anyways, let's put up the, uh, the extra armor over here. Like I said, uh, the prods, the saddles. You know what, I'll keep the saddles over here. That, 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 that makes a little bit more sense. And putting them up over here in the, the rare valuable stuff chest. I do know we have these hazard gloves here that we got, so that's good. Uh, I just need the hazard, what's it called, the helmet? That'd be a really good one to have, you guys, so... Put these up over here. I guess I'll put that structure up as well. And we have some random uh, things that we could eat, too. Uh, I don't know. Why is this thing over here? I should have put that in the heck of... Same with these. Oh, uh, yeah. I think I offloaded all the, uh, the the loot from finishing the mission. I think it just offloaded them into here just automatically. So let's grab those. Make sure they don't spoil. <laughs> Even though this is a little bit too late. I'm sure some of them have spoiled by now. But just put them up over here and uh, we should be fine. So put these up. And uh, I think we're good. There you go. All right. Well, now we can move on to yet another mission. Uh, I guess we'll see what we can do that we haven't done yet. Uh, that That's kind of different from what we've already done. And like I said earlier, I, I, I don't know why we haven't seen any glitches like you think we've seen them by, you know, adventuring around so much. But either way, bog beat down. Swarms of insects will try to overwhelm you with sheer numbers. Squish them good. I don't know. That, that seems like something we could do. And maybe I'll do the beta version for 13,000, 36,000 for the alpha. I haven't done an alpha one yet. I don't know if I want to do one just yet. I'm like, we just did a beta for the first time, and we, well, we honestly probably could have done that the first attempt. <laughs> but uh, unfortunately, we were unable to do it on the first attempt. It took us two times to do that. So, anyway, Spy versus Spino to take on this Brute Spino and but to like find its footprints and all that kind of stuff. I don't know if I want to do another one of those. A Brute Sarko was on the prowl, and that's the same thing. Yeah, so we could either find a Brute Sarko, a Brute Spino. Wasn't there a Brute? Oh, yeah, we already did a Bloodstock, yeah. And then, uh, the fight a bunch of insects. And that's it. Like, oh yeah, and then bog fishing. I guess we can try that out just to see what it is. Oh yeah, and then there's another race right there. Oh yeah, and then there's a scavenger hunt there too. But, uh, everything else we've done so far, and I can't do this one, I think, right? Go to all pickup game. Wait, what's the difference? It says 1 to 10, but it says there's teams. I don't know if I could actually do that in single player, but <laughs> either way, what, what, what can we do? Maybe I'll do the fishing just to see what it is. Because we've never done fishing before, you're only going to get 1,200 hexagons from doing the alpha, 400 from uh, 480 for doing the beta, and only 80 for doing the gamma. So, well, I guess we can try this one at 3,000 heckin' meters away, so it's going to be quite a ways away. Uh, wait, the, yeah, there you go. All right, let's see which way do I. Oh, there's an egg. Let's grab the egg. Just oh gosh, that was the wrong button. Wait, what? Wait, what happened to my hotkeys? That's the button I usually use to crouch. I, I guess I have to fix it. There you go, I fixed it. Alright, let's grab the egg after we just heckin' beat our dialer right there, jeez. And remember, we need to use this, uh, this shield more often, because it is better than the one that we have. Uh, do I want to use Ninja now, or do I want to use the same Spino for this one to go over there? Uh, oh man, our Parasaur has a level up right here. Uh, just one. Yeah, let's get a little bit of health. Sure, why not? I guess we'll take the Spino, and, uh, I guess we'll just go over there real quick. 
if we can on foot. Is this going to be worth it to go this way, though? Uh, let me get my spyglass back out. It's going to be southwest. Uh, I guess we could try and teleport. Uh, I guess we could do it. All right, well, where's Helena at? Can I even use her? Uh, why can't I? Yeah, I don't know why I can't use her while I'm on the Spino. It's like she doesn't like my Spino. Anyways, oh, there's something nearby. Oh, yeah, we can get a, uh, a tier two loot box now, but I don't know if I want to do that just yet. Let's go to southwest. And now uh, let's go bog fishing. Do we still have the fishing net? I think we do, right? Uh, yeah, there it is right there. Yeah, fishing net. So wind it up and throw it to catch nearby fish. I've never used that. We made that on like episode three or something. It was one of the first few episodes and I've never used it. So <laughs> might as well finally use it, right? Jeez. Either that or they'll, they'll probably give us a, uh, a net if I don't already have one. But at least I have one just in case. Anyways, we're going to teleport here in just a moment. All right, does this take us any uh, any closer? Uh, oh, yeah, it did. Yeah, okay, shaved off about uh, 2,000 meters right there. So not, 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 not too bad. All right, well, let's continue on this way until we actually get to the bog fishing mission. <laughs> a little bit of an unintentional rhyme right there. But, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys here in just a bit. Where we're, I guess, just going to go fishing. I, I, I don't know if there's anything special here or if I have to... Oh, gosh, there's, like, structures here. Wait, I don't think I noticed this before. Yeah, there's, like, structures here in the bog. Oh, is that a glitch? Oh, it is. Hey, we haven't had a... Oh, gosh, what is this? Uh, is this, like... Basically an obelisk or something. Hold on, we have a glitch right here. Wait, can I not use this? Do I have to leave the game and come back again? Just like that one time? Right before we did the frog mission? Yeah, I think I think I have to leave the game and come back. For some reason this isn't working. It might it might do that whenever you like teleport or something, because that happened like we found a, a glitch shortly after we teleported that one time too, and I'm unable to uh, interact with either one of these, so that's kinda of unfortunate. But I guess before we try and uh, reload the game and, and and oh gosh. And try and fix it, I do want to see if we can if I go down there, can I come back up? Like, it looks like it's just a giant waterfall in, like, a 360-degree sort of meme, so... I don't know if I can come up from there, you guys. I, unless I, like, teleport, of course, and I don't know if I want to do that. Jeez. So, oh, there's a raptor over there. Where even are we? Oh, gosh, yeah, we're, like, on the corner, basically. Sheesh. Oh, what is that? Something in the background back there? You guys see that thing that was, like, spinning right there? It's kind of crazy. I don't know where it is. Huh. But yeah, this is, uh, this is from the the video thumbnail, I think, right? That weird, like, tower that's right there? You can't even really see it because there's, like, fog and stuff all over the place, but... Yeah, it... I didn't even notice this area over here. I guess I've never been in this part of the bog yet. Jeez. But either way, yeah, yeah let me just reload the game real quick and we can try to get this glitch, get, like, what, a thousand hex guns and... I don't know, maybe we can go down there and see what that's about. See what that mission is down there. Or I guess we can just cycle through the other uh, stuff over here and it'll probably tell us, right? So, uh, is it this one, Bog Beatdown? Because I'm pretty close. Is that what this one is? Yep, yeah, okay, so it is Bog Beatdown. So I guess we're going to be basically trapped in this this waterfall area that's down there. And what is it again? Just fight a bunch of, uh, bugs or... Yeah, so, uh, swarms of insects will try to overwhelm you in sheer numbers, squish them good. So, I guess this is, uh, going to be kind of interesting down there. Where all the waters just kind of flow towards the middle there, and I guess we have to defend ourselves from waves of enemies or something like that. Waves of bugs or something crazy. So, either way, yeah, like I said, let me just reload the game, and uh, hopefully we can fix this glitch. Alright, guys, I'm back. And it looks like, yep, we can fix the glitch now, so... That's strange. This glitch was caused by repeated access to an old Earth text. In this case, a novel from the 1700s. Robertson Crusoe. Listen to this. I was wet, had no clothes to shift me, nor anything either to eat or drink to comfort me. Neither did I see any prospect before me but that of perishing with hunger, of being devoured by wild beasts. And that which was particularly afflicting to me was that I had no weapon, either to hunt and kill any creature for my sustenance, or to defend myself against any other creature that might desire to kill me for theirs. I dare say that sounds familiar. Yeah, it sounds like episode one, basically, right? Jeez. <laughs> now, while we're in the area, do I want to do this insect... whatever that was, the swarm mission, and then maybe we settle things down by doing the, uh... Do I already have it selected? Oh, I guess, yeah, we reloaded so it doesn't have any, uh... I guess we'll do the beta one. There we go. So, I. Uh, I guess we could do this one, so... If we go down there, I'll have to go teleport back to the bog southwest or whatever to get back up, I assume, right? I'm gonna try and fall into the water, or I guess I could just dismount right before we actually hit- Whoa, it's actually not that- I thought I was a little bit deeper than this. Oh, God! I guess, uh, our Spino did take a little bit of damage right there, I guess. <laughs> I didn't think we'd hit the, the ground that fast right there, but jeez. I might have to wait a little while for us to regen again. Jeez. Hold on, I'm, I'm gonna slow-mo one trillion this thing. 
And I'm gonna feed him a ton of food and hopefully, hopefully he's gonna be fine. All right, all right, there you go. Oh man, slow, oh God, slow-mo one. Oh, whoops, didn't put the space, slow-mo one. Woo, okay, we're back. Jeez, <laughs> man, so what, I don't know how much time I actually passed right there, but now it's almost nighttime right now, so uh, time to turn the gamma up. So there you go, that way we can actually see, but bug beat down. I don't know if this is gonna be hard or what, but uh, I assume, oh wait, does it, wait, which one was this in? Is this the one with the bugs? I didn't read it right there, I meant to. Uh, swarms of insects will try to overwhelm me with sheer numbers. Wish them good. Yeah, this is the insect one, but it has a picture of, like, raptors or something like that right there. Or baryonyx or something like that. Sheesh. Let's do the beta version of it. So there we go. Are you ready to face the gauntlet? Yeah, let's do it, Ada. Oh, wait, I can't... Only got me... Oh, yeah, this is... They're coming through the gateway. Ooh, spear. Was this bow and arrow? Okay, I guess we'll get a spear for right now. There's a bow and arrow right there. Oh god, giant bee. Oh man, 4,000, is that my damage? We shouldn't be buffed, right? Oh gosh. But yeah, I, I did read a comment a little while ago. Oh man, giant, huge Lymantria right there. Right th oh man, a, a Bloodstalker right there. Where's my, uh, spy oh, did my, sp I think I'm, yeah, my Spino definitely got uh, teleported out of here, you guys. Holy heck. But yeah, hey, we've got a spear right now, which is purely melee. I don't know if I want to switch out to a bow and arrow, because we're getting... Well, we're doing good on health, well on health right now, not bad. I, I, yeah, it seems like it's just- oh god, I got tranquilized. I think I have stimulants in my inventory, so I should be able to- uh, oh, whoops, that- I not mean to grab that, but uh, I guess we could use it to take on the radio. Oh, okay, waves completed, one out of five. Okay, that wasn't too bad. But yeah, now do we have- oh, I have unlimited ammo with this bow and arrow, nice. But yeah, now we have range, and uh, now we have like 15 seconds until the next wave, I guess? I guess we're supposed to settle down and uh, heal up or something like that in this intermediate bit. But yeah, it seems like they teleported my uh, my Spino away, so that's unfortunate. Uh, that would have been really helpful there. But then again, it, we're doing like 4,000, or almost 5,000 damage Stay for it. Here they come. Oh, flaming arrows now. Whoa, hold on. Where are the nearby enemies? Seems like over there's, oh, is that a, oh, yep, frog over there. Beals of a foe, 4,500, oh, 4, jeez, can't. Capersu yep, Capersu gets another frog. Oh wait, something behind, oh gosh. What is that, Wyvern? Poison Wyvern! Holy heck! Yeah, I kinda wanna... Jeez, there we go, took care of that. I can, uh, what do you call these over here? I forgot, Titanobos. Okay, let me, let me grab some... Uh, there we go, Spear. Let me grab a, uh, Melee. Golly, I can't even focus on what I'm saying right now. I'm getting heckin' tongued by all these heckin' frogs! Oh my gosh! Now there's a poison heckin', what do you call that right there? I forget. Yeah, I need, I need a, I need a bow and arrow against these frogs, you guys. Oh wait, is that... Oh, is this a flaming spear? I think it is. Ooh, that's pretty good. Uh, oh, 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 now I'm getting to the frogs. That's good. There we go. Take down these second frogs. Oh my gosh. The gateway will show up soon. Be ready. What is that? What's happening over there? They're like gateways opening on each uh, like pathway over here, I guess. But yeah, I did not know you could flame these. Uh, oh, wait, in the world, random actual wild over after right there. Oh my gosh. <laughs> but I did not know you could actually uh, flame spears unless you can't. And it's only for this mission, maybe. I don't know, but 10 more seconds. We did pretty well that wave. We, we did lose a little bit of health. We got like 20 points right there. Oh, what, what, are, what are these? Female Spino and... Oh, okay. They got put up inside a cryopod, so I guess... I wonder if I could throw them down right now, but... Here they come. We have like six minutes, right? Oh, what is this? What is this? Edmund... Oh, Edmundium Surges? I don't know what that is. Is that is that like a, a throwable or something like that? I assume. Maybe. Oh, wait. We have something in the... Uh, what was that on the bottom? A surge event. Oh man, quadrupling my damage. That's why we're doing a lot of damage right now. Because we have that, like, status effect or whatever. And we got, like, are these Zom Dodos? No, those are just regular Dodos. Jeez. Iguanodon, Pachyrinosaurus, giant heckin' Dodos. And, uh, tap Tapaharas. Why was wave. What was that? Wave 1 or 2 that we had heckin', uh. Oh, oh, another Tapahara right there. It looked like it was facing the other way right there. Jeez. 18,000 damage right there. Or X Tapahara, I guess you could say. Jeez. And again, this is flaming, like I said. Oh, crossbow. Really nice. Let's grab this. This might be really good. Just for uh, all right, yeah. I, oh, yeah. There, I could see like a cave or something like that over there. I don't know if it's the way out of here. Basically, that'd be pretty cool. But yeah, I don't know why there's wyverns on like wave two or one or whatever that was. Jeez. <laughs> and then we go to like dodos on wave three. But uh, now it's going to be ten more seconds till wave four. But we're actually kind of we're getting a little bit of torpidity. Yeah, slowly. I don't know if I want to take care of that just yet. Uh, I'll, I'll do that, just in case we come across any more Titanobos or whatever else. And, uh, we do have a really good weapon right now. Here they come. Any guns? Oh god, a Spino. 
Let's shoot that thing. It went 6,700 again damage. Oh my gosh. What is that thing? Oh, uh, Terror Bird, Terror Bird. Oh god, another spine. Man, I didn't check that. I didn't check that direction. 10,000 damage to that heck of Terror Bird. Another spine over that way. Another spine over here. Any more big old boys? Oh, 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 Terror Bird. Terror Bird Spino. Seems like that's all this uh, round is here, you guys. Unfortunately for this, 20,000 damage to heck of Dilos. Oh my god. Oh, I missed. Let me get the Terror Bird, though. Are we taking, like, increased... Yeah, we're taking, like, actually zero damage. I think it's because of our amazingly good armor, you guys. Because remember, we have, like, 2,000... Or, like, 2,500 or something like that armor rating. Oh, I picked up the spear, unfortunately. Where's the, uh, crossbow at? Oh, there it is right there. I, I think I'm going to keep the spear for right now, though. Also good, but another gateway should appear soon. Okay, well, if we're using melee like this, I'll definitely use third person. We can see a little bit... Oh, can I say hello? Get some, uh... There you go. Red hex scouts. Nice. And we just got, like, a 1,000 for fixing that, uh, glitch, so... Not bad. You want to get closer and close. You know what? I forget how many we get from this. Like, what, maybe 13,000 or something like that? Uh, I think this is the final wave. We should be able to afford a tier 3 loot box after this, right? That'd be really good, you guys. I'm looking at this bog beatdown. I, 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 this is beta, by the way. This is, this is, oh god. Boss is over there, heckin' giant. Oh man, I forgot the name of that thing. The giant spider boss. Oh, what is this? Yeah, that's like the buff, isn't it? Edmundium surges or whatever that is. I don't know if that's actually in my inventory or what, but uh, now we got pack of rhinosaurs over here. We've got the big spider boss. I forgot the name of. Uh, started with the letter B, I think. Hold on. Here we have kill 72,000 damage. Oh my gosh. There we go. Did I kill it? Not yet. There we go. There it is right there. Yep. Brood mother. That's what it's called. I knew it started with the letter B. I got it right there. Oh god, I picked up a picked up a bow and arrow. Oh no 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 no. I'm glitched. I'm glitched. I'm actually glitched. Hold on, I've got it. I've got it. There we go. I forgot this is an actual bow and arrow, not a crossbow, so I- Oh! Yeah, those are the- Oh, God! I just got knocked down right there! No! Oh, my gosh! I think- Yeah, I, I, I had, like, explosives or something like that right there, you guys, but unfortunately now- Can I wake up? Is my torpidity going up or down? I can't tell. It might be going up because we're getting attacked by a Titanobo right there. And I, I'll never be able to- Golly, this sucks. I wasn't looking at my heck of torpidity. And it, it's probably not gonna- Oh, kill it with fire! What- well, we have five minutes left, and my torpidity is, like, staying the same. It's not going... It's not going up, it's not going down. I'm trying... I'm looking at it right now. It's not really moving right now, you guys. Oh, my gosh. Uh... Do I have to redo this because I heckin' got knocked out right here? Are you kidding me? Oh, my gosh. <laughs> not like last time, where we almost beat it, and then we have to, like, redo it again. You know what? If that happens again, I'm gonna skip to, to, to wave five. Or, yeah, this is wave five. I skipped away five, and then we could just redo that rather than redo the whole thing, right? Jeez, save us a little bit of time, but man, I did not think we'd be able to actually get knocked out right there. I wasn't paying attention to my torpedo. I saw it earlier going up, took the stimulants, but yeah, man. Yeah, we're going to get like disqualified or something like that. My torpedo is actually not moving. I can't do anything right now. Like, I'm just sitting here. I'm like taking no damage, basically. I'm taking like fractions of damage because my health is going down, but my, uh, it just says zero right there because it's less than, uh, less than one that I'm actually taking per hit, so that's unfortunate. But yeah, because it's dumb heckin' Titanable, I'm not going to be able to heckin' wake up, you guys. So I'm, I'm probably going to end up failing this. Let me, let me just slow mo, like, there you go. Just kind of get it over with. I just go by faster. Yeah, I, I don't know if I'm going to die first or what. Yeah, look at that. My torpedo is actually not moving. Even with like time going by super duper fast right now. <laughs> Jeez. Yeah, we're going to fail right here. I'm going to have to, to skip. Yeah, there you go. You'll get it next time, Survivor. Yeah, I failed right there, unfortunately. And I'm still... my torp up, Survivor. Yeah, I know. My torpedo is still rising right now, too. Jeez. I was, I'm surprised it didn't go up even further right there with the Titanoboa continually biting on me right there. Jeez. But yeah, now I have to wait till I wake up and uh, I'll do the first four waves off camera. And I'll see you guys here in just a bit where we're about to start wave five. Hopefully, if we see any Titanobos, let's snipe them down first. Make sure this doesn't happen again. So, go to pause the recording, and I'll see you guys here in just a bit. Alright, guys, I'm back. And man, am I lucky, because one of the waves spawned heckin' flamethrower. So now we can actually, ba-boom, flame these guys up, especially in melee range. Because this is going to be crazy. I think it does like 900 damage per hit, or something like that. And of course, it's AoE, hardcore, so... As long as I don't accidentally pick anything else up... We should, but yeah, like down here, there's a pike. Oh, and there's the brood mother. So this is going to be great against the brood mother, but we have to be like rain, uh, melee range. I think that's the flamethrower right down there. Yeah, 675 damage. Of course, it's going to take a while to, to eat through all of her heckin' health, but at least we're doing damage to any nearby creatures as well, and hopefully not going to get knocked out again. Oh gosh. Oh man, I picked up a bomb. I picked up some heckin' grenades. Now I'm getting knocked out. I'm getting knocked out. Stimulants, stimulants. Oh gosh. Arrows. 
It's a brood mother, 10,000 damage, 11,000 damage, or whatever. Oh gosh. Oh, we got Hanky Tabahara's over here too. Try to aim down the brood mother. I don't know how much health she has. I should definitely check here in just a moment, but we do have a a, a, a flame spear right now. And brood mother down, brood mother down. I'm going to take another uh take another there it is right there. I should probably Oh wait, wait, oh I can't take it while I'm like in midair like that. Yeah, get out of here. Hanky. What are you calling the naked snake creature up again? Jeez. <laughs> There you go, we got it right there, you guys, nice. I killed 81 dinos, nice, awesome. Man, that really makes me want to make a Hagen flamethrower, nice. Oh, whoa! We got two tech helmets from that? And we got a uh, hazard suit shirt, nice. And we got a journeyman Parasera, or, yeah, Parasera Ethereum. I got it right, right there, nice. <laughs> Parasera Ethereum sad right there, nice. So we can probably grind that up and get some good money out of it, some flak armor right there. Kiting another uh, hazard suit shirt right there. More mushroom stew, more Lazarus chatter, and assault gun, or uh, assault rifle right there. Uh, fur leggings, that's going to be great for the next realm, you guys. Biome, whatever you want to call that. Random. Oh god, I got, man, I still got knocked out right there, man. Well, thankfully, in the middle of the battle there, I was taking stimulants. Probably should have put that in my hot bar in hindsight, but at least this time around, we're not going to be, you know, constantly getting, uh, let me, uh, slow-mo through this. I don't know, like, let's do that. Oh, whoops, I put the O there, so. There you go, just a bunch of numbers right there, and hopefully, oh, oh, we're about to, there we go, oh, whoo, there we go. I think we were able to use the shield during that, because it, it was technically in my offhand, but, uh, using the spear, using the bow and arrow, using the flamethrower, all that kind of stuff, they did take two hands to use them, so that's why I wasn't able to actually use the shield, unfortunately, but, yeah, you know, that flamethrower really makes me want to make one, you guys. Let's see how many, oh, we have 37,000 hexagons now, nice. Uh, flamethrower, oh, flame arrows, I can make those here, so that's good. Flamethrower, nice. Oh, yeah, it's a scorched earth thing. Did I ever make one on scorched earth? I don't remember. I might have, and I just never really used it. That's probably what I ended up doing. You can make a flame turret, too. Holy heck. <laughs> Seems pretty good right there. Oh, yeah, you need those, like, shell things for it. Yeah, I did make one in scorched earth. Yeah, I remember making those, like, uh, what are they called? Like, fuel cells or something like that? I forget, but I wonder if we have to make those fuel container. That's what it's called right there, but fuel container plus, so... If we want to make the flamethrower plus, we need 50 cement paste, 15 electronics, 35 metal ingots, 75 polymer, and 10 sulfur. We could probably make that, you guys. Now, what about the fuel containers? How do we make those? Fuel container plus. Just 100 gasoline. So we need oil, we need uh, hide, and then you, you basically cook that in a uh, forge. I think we have like 300 or something like that oil last time I remember, right? So we have a, a pretty good amount. So that's pretty good. I don't know if I want to do the... Uh, because that was relatively easy. You know, besides getting knocked out and stuff, we were doing tens of thousands of damage at one point down there. Jeez. So I, I, maybe, can we do the alpha? Maybe I'll, I'll save that for later. But I feel like we could probably do the alpha there, you guys. Like, holy heck. Actually, you know what? Yeah, we might as well do that right now. Like, I'm here. I, I might forget to come back. This is going to be our first time doing an alpha. And we got some really good loot right there doing the beta. So... Especially those two tech helmets, that's going to be great. Unfortunately, their armor rating doesn't really line up with the Flak uh, Plus or whatever that is right there, but still, it's a, a tech helmet right there, which I think helps you breathe underwater or gives you night vision or something like that, right? So, maybe get lost with the tech helmet. Yeah, and tech, yeah, it has night vision right there. Targeting mode that reveals other characters' positions and infinite oxygen. Yeah, it, okay, so yeah, it does have infinite oxygen. That's going to be great for the uh, ocean biome, so don't need a scuba tank for that, so that's going to be great. And uh, night vision. I don't remember using night vision. I guess we could put that all with. Oh yeah, I can't wear tech stuff because I don't have a, uh, I didn't defeat a boss yet. I forgot about that. Man. Yeah, so we have to do, where is it? Helena. We go over to, what was it? It was like this, right? Arrival protocol, yeah. And, uh, I need to hit 58 missions to do the very first one and we've only done seven. What? We've only done seven? Oh yeah, it could, yeah, because we only did the, uh, the gamma version of it. So I guess if we do the, uh, the beta and the alpha version of it, we could, we could triple all these. Pretty easily, so that 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 that, that doesn't seem too bad. Here in the bog, we have 40 missions apparently, so yeah, that, that that should just you know do all the bog and then maybe some Arctic, and we'll be able to do the first uh, boss mission there, you guys. But I, I doubt I'll do gamma, beta, alpha for everything. And speaking of alpha, we've done a lot of gamma, we've done a few beta now, or like two beta. Let's start an alpha, you guys. Do you guys want to try it for the very first time? Seems like we'll be able to do it on this for a mission like this where it's a like gauntlet. I'm actually surprised we might be able to do this, you guys, so let's do it. Alpha. Ready your weapon, survivor. We got a gauntlet ahead of us. Yep, but I assume we're going to be taking more damage. We're going to be dealing less that damage. Gateway. It's opening. Oh, man, I was about to say, it, it, there's probably going to be more waves, but no, it, it's still five waves. So 
That's going to be interesting. I do want to get my spine last out so I can actually uh, keep track of everyone's health. But Blood Stalker, 1.9k health. Oh, we've got Lymantrias. We've got Aranios around here. Yeah, we're doing 729 damage. Am I, t I, I feel like I'm doing my normal damage right now, you guys. Which, oh gosh, I'm going to get knocked out here pretty soon. I'm going to get knocked out. I, I need to... Oh, wait, no, my Torpidity's not rising, but... uh. Oh, there you go. But we're, we're still doing pretty well in health right now, which is good. Lymantria right there. I'm surprised it's not doing its, like, slowing mist attack where it like mists an area and every time if you if you're in that area you get uh, slowed down oh man <laughs> that man just got hit by a uh, web by another uranium right there so that's kind of funny but yeah we're not actually taking any torpedo right now which is great yeah another gateway is going to start soon but i'm going to take a, uh, a stimulant just in case right there just in case would you develop any uh, torpedo i'm just going to negate any of it right there so there you go we, we still have this spear which i know you can throw it but i don't want to oh gosh whoops wait my crap wait what Wait, what happened to my cryopods? They- Wait, what? They expired? No! No way! Wait, hold on. They're gone! It's opening. Oh my gosh, I wasn't even looking at them, you guys! We were- Oh my gosh, now I've gotta get the flame. You know what, you know what, I, I might have to reload a save or something, you guys. Because uh, our, our cryopods, I should probably uh, let the let the creatures out of the cryopods, and then let them reset. Man, let me, let me actually check. Because I don't want to lose any of this progress, you guys. We do have a save, but it just got overrided right there. I don't know if I just made a copy of it fast enough. You know what? Let me let me try it. Let, 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 we're only like one wave into this. Let's let's reload the game. Hopefully, we didn't lose those critters because the heckin' cryopods expire right there. You think they just run out of energy? But no, they just they broke. So you know what? I'm going to reload that save. Hopefully, it worked. And if not, then I guess I have to redo some stuff. All right, guys, I am back. Yeah, it looks like the uh, the, the, the cryopods expire in about two minutes, two seconds right there. So I'm glad that I made that back up right there. Let me equip. Let's throw them down. Because remember, whenever we actually start the mission, it's going to uh, put these guys in cryopods. So hopefully it just kind of re-ups those cryopods. And yeah, those cryopods just disappeared out of my inventory altogether right there. Okay, okay. Glad I did that. Let's, let's start the alpha again. And then these guys are going to get back into cryopods and... Uh, Hopefully they'll be completely full recharged. I think, what did they last, like 30 minutes or something like that? So, they're coming through the gateway. when they're doing a uh, slow-mo, or whenever I was doing like slow-mo one trillion right there, waiting for me to wake up, that, that made a lot of time pass right there, you guys, holy heck. But yeah, you know what, I'm going to put, oh man, we, got, we have heckin' stuff. I'm going to have to do it next wave, but I wanted to put stimulants in my hotbar so I could use them easily without having to go into my inventory and I forgot to do it. Man, we have giant queen bees and radios around here. Not really, I'm not seeing any titanobos. There may be some. I don't think the Uranios can knock- I don't remember if they can knock you out or not. But I'm- I, I think we're fine right now. We, we shouldn't have a- Oh yeah, we are gaining on Torpidity right now. I don't know if it's from Lymantria or from the Uranios or both or what. But yeah, we, we should definitely get those stimulants ready. Oh, there's a, uh, Mantis right there, so might as well put it down there. Get rid of the insect propellant thing. Because, uh, I'm like, we don't have any actual swarms. There you go. Yeah, can I use these while in my hotbar? Oh yeah, I was able to use the uh, the healing stews right there, so let me use that. Yeah, there you go. See, we could use those, no problem. We could use consumables, no problem. I could eat food, no problem. I just can't use uh, outside weapons, so that's kind of unfortunate. But now we're going to be starting wave two, which I think starts us off with flame spears and flame arrows and stuff like that, so that's going to be great. I don't know when do we get the flamethrower. That's going to be really good, you guys. Holy heck. <laughs> so definitely want to get that as soon as I can. I think it's like really far down here, so we're going to watch out for that. We spawn in. It's opening. Yeah, okay, let's grab a uh, flame spear. There you go. Yeah, I don't, see, I don't see the flamethrower just yet, you guys. And what is this thing that's going to give us the buff? Yeah, it's going to give us a buff. And then we have the heckin' Wyvern! We got him right there. Nice. Had to jump up and get him when you got him. That's good. Oh, yeah, and of course, yeah, we do more damage because we have a, a flame spear here. So that makes sense. Oh, did I? Oh, yeah, I was about to say, did I do the alpha right there? But I'm glad that I, I checked. You can just see it right above the thing. Yeah, we, we're doing alpha right now, which that's great. We do have Titanobos. So let's definitely keep an eye on our torpidity and make sure we don't gain any torpidity and get knocked out in the middle of the battle. And... You know, have to start all over again, right? Oh! I got him right there, but he has a lot of health. He has more health than uh, the previous waves. Had one more hit, and yeah, he's down right there. That's good. That's good. Glad that these things have infinite durability, infinite ammo, all that kind of stuff. We don't have to worry about these spears breaking. We just continually use these things like I can, uh, pikes, basically, so. I don't know why they give us metal pikes. I guess maybe they do more damage, although I don't know if they do or not. And now we've got these, like, frog guys tonguing me here. So, yeah, I should probably get a, uh... Maybe like a crossbow or something like that next. Especially, I, oh yeah, the last wave is when the, uh, the boss spawns in, yeah. We'll have to worry about that a little bit later. But yeah, we, we actually got pretty low on health right there, you guys. Let's take a uh, health right there. Healing to, uh, there you go. Or a medical brew, I think it's called. Yeah, I took a stimulant right there as well to make sure I don't get knocked out. 
hopefully now we get the flamethrower. Did we get the flamethrower right now? Seven seconds till when the next wave starts. I'm gonna take another med- uh, there you go. Medical brew. Make sure we won't have to die, but seems like we're doing all right. The gateway is open! I do not see the flamethrower. Yeah, I just see the flame crossbow and that's it. But, uh, as long as there's nothing crazy like a top of horror around here, you guys. Or, uh, <laughs> nothing like a, uh, what do you call it, uh... Titanaboa, that's what it's called. Top of horror, we can take those on, no problem. We just did, no problem right there. And we've got a... Uh, man, we're taking, we're actually taking some damage. Like, single digit damage, but it'll add up over time, I'm sure. Yeah, look at that, two, six. And we're doing good damage to these Parasaurotheriums and Pachyrhinosaurus and stuff like that. I'm gonna go take a medical brew right now, there you go. And then a Pachyrhinosaurus right there. Dodos around here, big dodos. Level eight, and it's down. Yeah, we only took three damage right there, but it'll add up. Let's take down this Parasaurotherium. Probably should get a range, but... There we go, we took him down, no problem right there, that's good. And, uh, yeah, it seems like the water just kind of flows you back towards the center here if you, if you, like, stray off path a little bit. But another gateway should appear soon. Okay, so that's, that's three waves down right there, and we actually did pretty well on health. Let's take another stimulant, let's take another healing stew. I think we have zero after that, right? That's the last one. Can't tell, it says ammo in the clip, and it doesn't tell me anything right there, number-wise. So I think that is our last medical brew right there, so we might want to watch out for that. Let's eat some food, hopefully regen from that instead. And, uh, hopefully, uh... Hmm... Next wave after this one is going to be the boss. I don't know what we should. Pro I don't know if the cro crossbow is probably what we're going to get for that one then. Here comes another wave. So at the end of this wave. Oh, there's the flamethrower, I think. Or is that the harpoon gun? I think, it's, yeah, it's the flamethrower. Flamethrower, nice. Let's go first person mode. Now we got raptors. There we go. Take it down there. Good raptors now. Burning them up, Hater. Take down the terror bird. Spino. Can I get the Spino? Spino's not going to go down quite as easily, unfortunately. Oh, gosh. Yeah, we're, we're getting hit by the uh, Dilos here, too. Spino's down, though. That's good. Baryonyx. Oh, gosh. Eat some food. Man, another Spino right there. I can't really see it too well, but we should probably get a speed. Oh, gosh. I'm going to take a uh, Medical Brew. Medical Brew has been taken. No, we're going to... Oh, oh, I thought we were going to get knocked out right there. Definitely not. Raptor's down. That's good. I'm going to get uh, a Pike. I'm going to get a Pike. Dilo down. Golly, I can't see. How many more creatures are there? Where is any, uh... Oh, oh, oh Dilo. Whoa. That was close. We have no health. We have no health, or no no healing, and basically no health, too. We have broken bones. Oh, gosh. Do we have anything here I could eat? Lazarus Chowder. Consume it to slow your rate of oxygen and gain extra health regen. Okay, let's, let's get that, then. I, like, pretty much never use those types of consumables, you guys. So let's grab that. What about, uh... Let's see. Causes your... Lose that? No, I'm okay. I'm not going to get that one. Uh, healthy syrup to protect your pets from radiation. I don't think we need that. Oh, I should probably take this. Yeah, definitely want to take that, you guys. Let's get the flame pike right there, and there's the uh, the boss. Where's the uh, crossbow? I want to get the crossbow. Take down the Uranio brood mother. God, I can't do it. Baryonyx and Spinos and everything over here. I have no health. I'm gonna die, man. I'm not prepared. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna get knocked out too. I'm gonna. I'm getting webbed. Oh, there's the, uh, oh, man, Titanobos too. Titanobos too, and I'm dead. Man! <laughs> yeah, I should probably come back here with more medical brews, you guys. Man, we used up a lot of them right there. Jeez! 